and it, it needs to be stopped. And the way to stop it, as I've said in my book, uh, which you kindly plugged just now, uh, plugging again, mm. Land of Milk and Honey, is mm. a clarity act. Uh, Westminster needs to pass yes. a clarity act, as <laughs> they did in Canada, and put a stop to this never end well, well, let me let me talk about that Clarity Act, because uh, I don't want to <laughs> drive everyone to switch over to other channels uh, with the uh, Canadian government's Clarity Act. But I'm very familiar with that because of the same situation in Quebec. They called it the Neverendum. I mean, basically, one side is allowed to hold as many referenda as it wants until they get the right result. And then that's it. That's when the referenda ends because you become an independent country. And, and the Canadian thing was designed to say, no, 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 wait a minute. Everybody else in the existing country has a say in this. And if Quebec is divisible, if Canada is divisible, then so is Quebec. Likewise, if the UK is divisible, then so is Scotland. And you're not going to take the whole of the ancient kingdom of Scotland with you. The, most of the islands are going to vote to remain in the UK. And just like other islands, there's no reason why they shouldn't stay in the UK. Yeah, that's exactly right. So, you know, we, we, we've introduced the idea of this indie postcode lottery. Uh, you know, it would make mm. no sense for Scotland to go in independent, to separate from the UK, because it would just implode. There is no way that the south of Scotland would be happy to go with uh, under the, the control of the, the central belt, effectively, into uh, a separated state. Uh, Shetland and Orkney uh, certainly wouldn't. And so um, Skexit would, uh, would suddenly spawn a whole lot of other exits as well. Shexit um, mm. and uh, yeah. Borksit, for, for, ex for example, the borders. Um, and I think, yeah. you know, the, the, the important thing about these uh, referendums is that they should really enshrine the, uh, the settled will of the people. Uh, they shouldn't just uh, provoke division. And that's why I think a Clarity Act with a, a higher bar for triggering it and then for actually mm. uh, seceding uh, and taking the whole of Scotland yeah. with you into a, a state that would actually work where everybody would be happy to be in it.